everybody. We are going to do Watermelon Dolly Rancher Moonshine. I don't know if, it, if you can call it moonshine because really? it's not moonshine. So, Watermelon Dolly Rancher Mixed Drink Party Drinking Stuff. Because, yes, it's technically not real moonshine. So, here's our Dolly Ranchers. We're going to open up. I got them separated for each batch. So we're going to open them up, put them in the mason jars, and do a quarter of the Everclear, a quarter cup of grenadine, and then top it all off with watermelon crush. Now, the actual recipe would call for actual just Sprite, but we want to flavor it up. So we found the watermelon crush, and that's what we will be using on this batch. All right, let's open up these Jolly Ranchers. Okay, so first we are doing half Everclear. Yes, I am still finishing off my 151 proof because you cannot buy anything higher here in the state of Michigan. So half. There's ha oh, you're gonna need a bigger bottle, honey. Mm, just this put. It's gonna be mixed. All right, now I'm going to break out my 190 proof bottle that we had to go get in Wisconsin. Okay, this was the biggest bottle I could absolutely find at the grocery store when we were in Wisconsin. So yes, 190 proof because us Wisconsinites like our liquor. Oh my goodness. I'm going to have to make sure that I put an X or something on top of that one so I don't drink that one. Oh my goodness. Okay. So 190 proof right there. You guys see that? This was the first little bit we put in. One fifty one. All right. Now a quarter cup of the grenadine per batch. Top it all off. The recipe actually would call for Sprite. But we're trying to match flavored sodas with the flavor of Jolly Ranchers. Just gonna fill her up. Alright, there's the fill line. So that will be my point that I'm working for. That one a little bit more because. <laughs> well, I'm just going to the top line above the 24 ounces. So. And we'll just. And then it says to shake it to help, I guess, explode it. To make sure it all dumps on the ground, of course, on the counter. I would have waited until you that was tight, but okay. I thought it was tight. Well, yeah, soda. You don't shake soda. I'm just doing what the recipe says, and it says to shake it. Not to yell at me. I'm just the recorder. Well, I got a big old mess here. You should have licked that all up. I just taste like the soda. Mm -hmm. So it says it can take like up to 10 hours for the Jolly Ranchers to dissolve, but I think our last batch that we did on this... It took longer. But it also, it also does say the longer it sits, the, the better, better it tastes. tastes. So that's why we're getting these going now, because we want to get them sitting for a while. And we were going to be doing every flavor of the Jolly Ranchers in the bag, eventually. But this is what we had enough for, and with the soda, so watermelon was first. So if your life isn't interesting, make it interesting. Winners never quit and quitters never win. 
And uh, in about, uh, I don't know, a month or so, we'll let you guys know how they taste. All right, guys. Peace out. We'll see you on the next one.